In this suicide prevention month, there is probably no group more impacted at the moment than our veterans in the U.S. Department of Veterans Affairs trying to reach veterans who are struggling as we speak. The statistics show why with a troubling rise in veterans committing suicide. Jonathan Cota with how the VA is trying to take mental health wellness from the back lines to front and center. With the rate of suicide among veterans on the rise, Dr. Matthew Miller, Executive Director of Suicide Prevention for the VA, says it's critical to spread the word that suicide is preventable. No better time then than now to talk about the importance of reaching out, asking for help, and us providing solid resources for veterans. Outside of diagnoses and disorders, Miller says day-to-day -day life, like relationships, financial pressures, and occupational concerns can sometimes be too much for some. It's important to know then veterans uh, can reach out when they're experiencing these very common issues. They don't need to be embarrassed. They don't need to be ashamed. And they're not going to take resources from other veterans by reaching out. The VA has launched a new PSA for their ongoing campaign, Don't Wait, Reach Out, where vets who feel they are struggling are encouraged to visit the comprehensive website va.gov slash reach. So what you'll see when you go there is that the content is organized based on emotions and feelings. You know, if I'm feeling isolated, I'm feeling anxious, I'm feeling depressed or circumstances, you know, issues with jobs, transitions, relationships, divorce, housing. Once you click on an emotion or circumstance or connected with education, information, and direct access to resources available through the VA. There's navigation by uh, feelings and situation, not by diagnosis or disorder. Mm -hmm. I think that's meaningful to veterans. Reporting front and center, Jonathan Cotto, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.